Mark, Mark Jacobs. What's up, my brethren? Not you guys. <coughs> now what's that supposed to mean? Yeah, we're on our best behavior. Your reputation precedes you. And uh, what's that supposed to mean? You're troublemakers. Uh, 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 us? Trouble we're, ju we're just misunderstood. Yeah. And we will prove to you. Yep. We will prove to you that we're not bad. You will. Through random acts of service. Q montage. montage. I really oh, need this no, broom. It's okay. No, don't seriously, worry. you're no, gonna get me no, in trouble. No, no, I need this. You I don't want to touch this. You're gonna get it's me fired. Good. Why are you poking me with a broom? What are you doing? That's no, 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 no! Please don't. Please go away. Give me the broom back. Give me no, the broom I back. The Just stop it. Stop. I'm stop. The... Stop. Please. Ah! You want to buy it? What's up everybody, it's Indiana. Welcome back to another episode of Brad Chat. Today we're gonna be spilling some major tea with Lauren Geraldo in a game of Sip or Spill. We also have a really cool musical performance coming up, so stay right here. What's up guys, I'm here with Lauren Geraldo and we're about to play Sip or Spill, so let's get into it. Let's go. So, first question. If you could only make videos with one creator for the rest of your life, who would it be? Um, I'd pick like whoever's most poppin', so hmm. let's go with Emma Chamberlain. What do you like about Emma's vlogs? I love her editing style. <laughs> me too. It keeps me so interested. Yeah, it really does, it's really funny. Ooh, who's your favorite co-star on Baby Doll Records? Arielle. I really like her, she's so funny and she's yeah. so easy to work with. She is. Who's your celebrity crush? Uh, my celebrity crush? Um, I just don't know right now, so I'll, I'll spin. Okay, spin. Go ahead. Okay. Takes it like a champ. I love that. Love that. Okay, next question. What was your favorite thing to shoot on Baby Doll Records? There was this one scene that we shot um, in like the high school hallway and it was just really intricate. Like it required like a lot of walking and turning and different camera angles. 10 people I think like in the scene total wow. without stopping. So that was that was a cool one. If you had to watch one channel on YouTube for the rest of your life, what channel would it be? Uh, Jeffree Star. <gasps> He's funny. Yeah. yeah. I could just, I watch like, oh man, mm, Shane Dawson. Well, I was literally about to say Shane Dawson. Yeah. His new series are so good. The Jeffree Star one, the yeah. Jake Paul one. Yeah, okay, Shane. Shane Dawson, same. What was the most challenging thing about shooting Baby Doll? Um, uh, I don't know, I'm in the mood to spin though. Okay. I just want to see what else we have. Is it gross? I don't know. Pumpkin, yeah, pumpkin space. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and that was our last question. Thank you guys so much for joining us. See you guys next week. Right, right. Keep going, guys. Hey guys, it's Andy the Blanc here. Right now, we are at the music video shoot for Love at First Sight. Every time I come onto the Brat set, it's completely different. Like last week, we did an 80s theme, and then I come in this week and I see this really cool set with like all these green things. Actually, I feel like my feet and my hands are permanently stained green from all the moss and grass and everything. <laughs> When I first heard this track, I thought the music video was gonna be like super lovey-dovey, but when it turned out to be like sci-fi, I'm actually super excited on how it's gonna turn out. <laughs> the song is actually in Chicken Girl season three. Ryan sings this right as she comes off to the stage, like it's her like song where she comes into the spotlight. So from working on Chicken Girls with Annie and then now to this music video, it's been super fun. Like we've had such a blast filming all this. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's how you do it. <laughs> you guys are gonna really like this music video. It's completely different from all the other music videos I've done, and I'm really excited for you guys to see it. Let's see what happened this week on Brat. On Chicken Girls, it's finally the day of the musical, and our Rodeo and Juliet cast is ready. Maybe. Angie is struggling with her part, and when she has a meltdown, Rhyme has to jump in and save the show. Once Rhyme takes over, the show goes off without a hitch. But Rhyme's not the only one having to save the day. Ellie tells Tim the truth about Beatrice's bet with the other bees, and the two band together to finally take down the Mean Girls once and for all. On Manny, Mr. Miyoshi continues to lead the kids on their quest through the Jitterbug factory, and the challenges just keep getting harder. 
Facing certain death, Hank reveals his true identity to Dylan and the two are able to solve the riddle together. But Dylan forces Harmony to go through the next level without him. Upstairs, watching in horror, Manny has been tied to a chair by Miss Haruto, who is actually evil. I did not see that one coming. And Sky and Brittany arrive to save their friends, but then they get captured by cooties. Yikes. Take my time. 